Welcome to the Best Best Headquarters in Southwest London. My name is William Hindmarsh, Managing Director. It's the 5th of January, Happy New Year everyone, and today we're judging Dream Car Competition Reference SC930, which ran from the 29th of December 2014 to the 4th of January 2015. I can confirm that all competition entry data has already been passed to our independent competition auditors. Welcome to Kennedy. Our first judge is Peter Koshalek. Good morning. My name is Peter Koshalek. Um, I'm a referee of some 22 years standing. Uh, AFA uh, committee member, mentor and a um, formerly 25 years of playing football. Thank you. Great. Our second judge is Sol Campbell. Morning Sol. Morning. My name is Sol Campbell. I've played 20 years in the Premiership, played centre three times for England. Happy New Year. Our third judge is Mr Mike Naylor. Morning Mike. Thanks Will. I'm Mike Naylor, I'm Treasurer of the AFA and I've officiated in both the UK and the USA for a number of years. Lifelong football supporter and played until I was 50. Thanks very much indeed. Thanks Mike. Our independent lawyer today is Mr Andrew Penfold from Parfit Creswell. Morning Andrew. Morning to you. Andrew Penfold, partner of Parfit Creswell Solicitors in Fulham. Happy New Year. Great, so as an enhancement trial today, we're going to ask each of the referees today just to mark quietly on their own where they think, in a couple of minutes, where they think the centre of the ball should be. After that time, we're then going to get them to all debate their different positions and come to an agreed decision together. So now, quite simply, we're going to have two minutes, which isn't going to be the best TV view, I'm afraid, but two minutes where they can look at the picture and mark where they think the ball should be. So. Two minutes, judges, if you could please um, have a quiet look and uh, get your thoughts together and place one cross on the screen. Thank you. Okay, how's everyone getting on with that? Great, well quite interesting. Um, I'm in the position of seeing everything. Um, and fairly similar um, situations. Certainly Mike and Sol, very similar. Um, Peter, a little bit higher. Um, so I think the next stage is if you could all now, Peter, if you could just give your quick rationale, Sol and Mike <coughs> the same, and then if you could all try and come to a final decision, that would be great. Okay, well, uh, just trying to take into account the big pitch here with the body shape and the actual uh, positioning of the eyes, both players in the uh, picture. Uh, nothing else from the background lends itself to uh, helping uh, me on my final decision there. But uh, given um, what, what's in front of me, I'm reasonably happy uh, with uh, my positioning. Possibly it could be a little bit lower, but um, I'm reasonably happy with that one. Okay, great. So. Um, I, where I put where I put the cross is for me is the best place for uh, someone trying to well they're kind of fighting for the ball. The uh, defender in red, he's, he's he's got his eyes fixed and looks like he's gonna you know, he's gonna win the ball. 
but uh, the forward uh, with his body shape, um, fighting for the ball, but it's kind of in the middle. You know, the way his eyes are positioning, positioned, uh, it just looks like he's just kind of get, getting out of his out of his range and into the defender's range to kind of head the ball. But it's in the middle. So it's not a fight ball, but for me, it looks like it's. it's the uh, defender is going to get the ball, and it's just in that middle range where both of them are trying to fight for it. But I think in the end, the uh, defender will, will get the ball because the uh, forward is just a little bit out of it, and he's not. It's almost like, oh, it's, it's got it out of my head. I can't win it, but I'm going to try to try to do something to stop him. So that's Great. Why I kind of. Okay, well, fantastic. Well, Thanks. Mike, looking at your screen, you're in very similar positions yourself, I must yeah. say. Well, what, what I see here is that the, uh, the blue player is, is uh, backing into the red. He sees the ball getting close to the red player's head, so he's backing in to try and get, a, get an angle on that. Um, neither of them appear to be off the ground. Even so, I think the ball is quite close to him. I think the nature of the challenge means that it's very difficult for him to get off the ground here. And uh, my positioning is, is so that the, uh, the, the red player has got his eyes on the ball, dropping towards him. The blue player is trying to get into position, but he's not quite made it. Great. So thanks, Joseph, for your individual uh, goes. Now what I'm going to do is turn the screen record software on, on the main screen. So please, if you then debate where you think the centre ball is, uh, you can obviously have some quite similar ideas. Uh, if you can mark that on, I'll just turn that on now. So. Great, so the screen capture software is now running. If you can now use your wisdom to mark where you think central ball should be. Okay, well, I think the, uh, the, the blue shirt is, is odds against to get this ball. He's backing into the red defender, yeah. isn't he? And uh, he's trying to make something of a nuisance of himself, but mm -hmm. the, the, the red guy's going to get the ball here. Yeah, I think he's, so. he's totally in control. Yeah. So we could kind of look at his eyes. The yeah. ball's going to hit his head. Yeah. The way he's kind of positioned. So we look at his eyes, maybe can someone put a As I said earlier on, I yeah. think uh, my initial uh, positioning could be a little bit lower. Should we say about there? To start, start off with yes, yeah. Okay. And if we that's that's good Mike, yeah, we'll look at that. I think that might be a little too close to both. You think we need to nudge it up a bit? Slightly higher? Yeah. Yes. I, th I think so, so. Okay. So about there? Yeah. Should we say? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go from there. Have a look at his eyes. I'm thinking that um, I wonder whether his eyes seem to be going a little bit further over to the right here. I think the ball's gone past him. Okay. And he knows okay. he's going past him. Yeah. And he's going to his head. To you know the defender's head. He's in control. Yeah. It's already. Um it could be slightly, you know, going towards him, I don't know. What do you reckon? Again, I think so possibly slightly higher. Slightly Just higher. A bit, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, put the stick across yeah. there, uh, Mike. Yeah, I, I think yeah, that's just go for a cross. That's really good for the blue guy. The red guy I'm still thinking about. I think I think we shouldn't move from this vertical line yeah, here. Yeah. Because that's where his eyes are going, the, mm. the blue shirt. But I'm just wondering the blue shirt knows he's gone. He yeah. gone. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just wondering whether we've got the right sort of left to right for the for the, for the defender. For, yeah. For yeah. the defender, correct. And again, Possibly a little bit higher. Does yeah. a smidgen? Yeah. Okay. I'm I think those eyes are good for him. Yeah. I'm reasonably happy with that. And I think with him, the defender, I think that's pretty good for the defender, though. Have a look at his eyes. Yeah. Between both his eyes as well. Just Can you take the magnifier off him again? So yeah. It's, 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 yeah, I'm reasonably happy with that. I think that's that's pretty uh, good position. I think yes. Yeah. 
Perfect. Yeah. Okay. Great. Okay. Great. Thank you, judges. I will submit that now for judgment. Great. So the. Pixel selected is one one five three seven eight three one one five three seven eight three one one five three seven eight three. These coordinates and now we pass to the independent auditors Wilkins Kennedy to calculate the winner of this competition. Fantastic! So we look forward to receiving the winner details um, and see who will be joining last week's winner, Mr. Paul Ward, who won a fantastic Range Rover Sport plus ten k. Uh, so thank you very much judges and uh, good luck everybody.